Hi guys, happy Tuesday. Hope y'all are having a good morning. I'm still like half asleep to be honest. <laughs> I am, I'm half asleep. But I wanted to come on and go ahead and do wake up to makeup and play with some pigments today. Um, I'm starting to get a little bit more comfortable with them. So um, yeah, we'll play with them today. Um, I look like a zombie. <laughs> I slept like crap last night. I'm like, ugh. okay, so I'm starting to drink more water, I'm trying to take better care of myself, and now I can't go sleep. <laughs> I'm like, ugh. All right, so I'm starting off with a little bit of moisturizer. Today I used the um, Calendula uh, cleanser toner, and now I'm using the um, Calendula face cream. Um, it's got SPF 15, so that's pretty sweet. But go ahead and hydrate my skin <laughs> hi guys hope y'all are having a good day I'm trying so hard today to stay in a good mood like I'm so tired <laughs> I am so tired I'm one of those people that if I wake up too early and I can't go back to sleep and I feel like I'm tired I'm just like for the rest of the day until I've had like oodles of coffee but yeah I woke up at 6 45 this morning looked out the window I'm like it's bright outside dang <laughs> and I just laid there because I'm like okay I'm gonna go back to sleep and um, hopefully have enough rest before the kids get up and then you know lay in there anticipating them to wake up anytime yeah I couldn't go back to sleep so 6 45 I'm just like what is life I finally got out of bed at like 8.30. I'm like, okay, gotta get stuff rolling today. Got the kids up, breakfast done, chores and all that. So now they are doing their own thing and I'm doing my own thing. I've gotta sit down today and get some of their schoolwork organized. I've been laying in the bed, printing worksheets off of my phone because we homeschool. So I've been printing a ton of worksheets off of my phone. So now I have to sit down and organize them what worksheet goes with work days assignments? I'll end up getting ahead of myself and printing way too many and then can't remember what day goes where. So I need to stop today and actually get that organized. <laughs> all right, so I put on a little bit of primer and now I'm putting on a little bit of concealer to cover up all my blemishes and dark spots. I need to put on some lip conditioner. My lips feel super dry. I caught myself chewing on my lips when I was in bed last night. So, definitely need some lip conditioner today. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Like, every time I go live, I feel like I get a frog in my throat and I have to sit there and clear my throat like a hundred times. Like, my kids are on summer break. There's no reason for us to be getting up at the butt crack of dawn, though. Hey! My cats have decided to go bananas. My is in there like, Elfo, be nice. Elfo's the cat that we have that doesn't know how to be nice. The cat's a butt. Alright, so I'm going to put just a little bit of um, transparent powder up underneath my eyes where I put that concealer. Just a little bit. Hi guys, hope y'all are having a good day. All right, so I'm put just a little bit of eyeshadow primer on now. I love eyeshadow primer. It leaves your eyelids, you know, neutral tone to be able to put eyeshadow over it. The pigment or eyeshadows will last longer and they appear more vibrant to me. Like, I love this primer. I don't love my eyebrows though. <laughs> they all kind of wonky. Today, I did try to pluck them last night. I sucked it up and tried to pluck some more and I feel like I plucked like half of this side off. So, <laughs> I gotta work with it. I gotta grow them back. Luckily, I have some bomb lash stuff and eyebrow stuff. Alright, so let's get in there and fill these little bad boys in. Okay. 
so it don't look as bad. <laughs> Golly. I need someone to like live in my house with me and every time I feel like I'm gonna get pluck happy with my eyebrows is it gonna slap my hand like no <laughs> don't do that because I did I got a little happy on this side oh, well. oh guys last night we had our um, six o'clock training in the um, exclusive training program that I'm in and so while I'm sitting there listening um, to what they were having to say. I was sitting there cleaning my makeup brushes. So I finally cleaned them. They, they're so soft today and smell good. That tea tree soap is the best. For these brushes. Sorry, when I get focused, I kind of like trail off what I was saying. I feel like I'm behind today though. Like I feel like I've forgotten to do something. You ever feel like you've forgotten to do something and then you're like, what is it? And it's just sitting there nagging you in the back of the head. Oh, I don't know. I guess I'll figure it out after I get off live. <laughs> but I swear, I feel like I've forgotten to do something today. I did. I forgot to take my medicine this morning. <laughs> I sure did. Oh my goodness. Forgot to take my medicine and forgot to start the laundry. I was so excited to jump on live this morning and play with pigments that I could just completely forgot. Oh yeah. Luckily, it's still early in the morning and I can get it done after I go live. I'm trying to get a new schedule as far as when I go live, when I do certain things around the house, um, to make it a little bit easier. Because I've been honestly running around with a chicken with its head cut off. I mean, I've never seen a chicken with its head cut off running around, but you get the idea. I mean, it's been wild over here. And today's a special day. It is mine and my husband's eight year anniversary of being together. Not being married, but just, you know, dating and all that, being actually together. Eight years, guys. Holy Toledo. And then he's got to work tonight. But he will be off tomorrow. Tomorrow and Thursday. So I'm getting back out of the house. I'm going to try to go up to the woods again. <laughs> I'm serious. I love going out there. Oh, my hair's a mess, guys. Oh. Whatever. I'm just gonna call it hashtag mom life hair. Seriously. Mom life hair. <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm getting coming out of something. My throat's not clearing up like it's supposed to. <clears throat> like I'll clear my throat and drink something. I'm still not clearing up. All right, so I'm gonna put on a little bit of this lip conditioner. Right quick. I finally started the new season of Ozark. And so far I'm like, this is getting very interesting. Oh man, cause it took me forever to get through the first two seasons cause I kept getting bored. And um, so I'm like, all right, I'm going to try the third season now that I'm done with the first two. It's getting good. It's actually really getting good. But after Ozark, I need to find something new to watch. Like, I'm running out of shows. <laughs> I will sit there and watch Facebook and see what other people are watching to find something to watch. <laughs> like, I don't know anything that's out now. I honestly live under a rock. I don't have cable. I don't have satellite. I don't have anything but internet and a fire stick. But with our fire stick, we can pretty much stream whatever. I just don't know what's popular, I guess. Unless I Google it. But I don't want to Google something to watch. Shoot. By the time I sit down in bed and finally get to the 
There's something on my lip. Finally get to the point of wanting to watch TV at night. I'm like, I don't want to go Google nothing to watch. So I'll sit there and hawk Facebook. <laughs> see what all's out. Like I had no clue about the Tiger King until I saw it on Facebook. I'm like, what the hell is this? Excuse my language, but what is this? Let me check this out. And I ended up loving it and hating it at the same time. We had a love-hate relationship. <laughs> like, I couldn't stand that Carol Baskins lady. And whoever set those alligators on fire. Oh my gosh. So, if you've seen it, you know what I'm talking about. It was just a whole, it was weird. It was like a mind, the whole time you're sitting there watching the Tiger King, it's like a mind warp. <laughs> I'm like, what in the, what's going on? You know? I'm like, what? I swear. But I need something good to watch. I don't need something that I'm just sitting there bored and then watch my phone all night. I don't want to do that because I'm getting to the point where I'm staying up way too late just scrolling Facebook. <laughs> like, seriously. I did watch the new episode of Family Guy last night. Like, as much as I could before I started drifting off to sleep. There's one more episode of Family Guy coming out and then they're going to be done with that season. I'm like... Yeah, I need some new stuff to watch. I can't wait until um, the new American Horror Story comes out. That is going to be, oh my gosh. I can't wait. I cannot wait. Because I heard that Evan Peters is coming back on American Horror Story. Y'all, it's just it is not the same without him on there. And I heard that he's coming back. I'm like, yes, yes. <laughs> I'm so tickled. But I could completely understand why he had to take a season off. Like... Some of the stuff that he's having to portray as is like, oh, you know, but I'm excited, but usually they don't come out until like Halloween time, so spooky season needs to come on. I'm over this spring and summer stuff. I'm ready for spooky season. I'm going to try to go live this year and attempt a Halloween look, because usually when I do Halloween looks, I will not be on camera, because usually... I will have a couple of choice words to say, um, so hopefully I can do it this year without having to worry about watching my mouth. It's like once you start a habit, it's like smoking, once you start a habit, it's hard to break. Like, I bought a vape a couple weeks ago trying to quit smoking cigarettes. I don't know when's the last time I touched that vape. It was just, I've gotten into the habit of smoking cigarettes, and I need to stop. <laughs> I'm trying, though. It's just stress, especially when you got these kids running around going, ah! all day, every day. I'm actually surprised they're being quiet right now. Matter of fact, I don't know where they are. I think they're in the toy room, or color. They're in their color. At least they're being quiet. <laughs> So we're going to get into the pigments today. I've got two pigments. I've got the violet and I've got the silver cosmic color. So I'm going to be using both of those today. I absolutely loved how my makeup turned out when I used just the violet pigment as eyeshadow on my, on my lids and stuff. So I'm going to use both of them today and see how they look together. It's either going to look good or I'm going to look like a sparkly mess. So we'll see. Ain't it pretty? It's so clean. Sorry, I'm obsessed with my brushes and I'm obsessed with how clean they can get. <laughs> it feels so nice. All right, here we go. And this is the first pigment I'm using. It's called Violet. Oh, Y'all excuse the frog in my throat. It's getting on my nerves so bad. All right. I'm trying not to get too much on my brush because it is loose pigment. It's all loose powder and I'm not looking to make a mess. <laughs> Alright, here we go. 
I'm gonna put it all over the lid first and then work in my other colors later. I just wanna get this all good and blended before I move on. This is actually a crease brush, but I use it for a blending brush because I have a smaller crease brush. This is my crease brush that I normally use. And then this is supposed to be a crease brush. You see the difference in size? So I use this one for blending and it works better for me. my youngest too today. But what do y'all want for dinner? I ain't got the foggiest idea of what I want to cook today. And they're both like, straight off. I'm like, well, that was easy. Why can't y'all be like this every day? <laughs> Especially with something that can cook super easy. Like, straight off is like one of my go-to easy, I don't want to cook night meals. <laughs> like, seriously. I mean, I can't give you my recipe. That's my mama's recipe. But, um, they love it. They absolutely love it. I want to learn how to make stroganoff in the crock pot. Make it that much easier. Because <laughs> it's getting to the point, five, six o'clock, when I'm at t it's time for me to go in there and actually cook dinner. I am so tired. I'm just like, no. <laughs> no. No, why can't I just order takeout? But takeout gets to be expensive, guys. I have to get so tired, I don't want to cook. So I, I'm one of those people, if I can throw it in the crock pot and cook it all day, I will be more than glad to throw it together first thing in the morning. <laughs> like, all right, at least I know what I'm eating, right? You know what I'm saying? I can't, ugh. I love to cook, though, that's the problem. Like. I just don't, I'm tired, you know, I'm just so tired, and um, they're like, well, you love to cook. Yeah, I used to want to be a chef when I was little, but being a short order cook for little kids that like to be picky is kind of, it's draining sometimes, <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, gosh. All right. And it takes me forever to do my eye makeup, but once I get this done, everything else just moves pretty quick. <laughs> Plus, I like to jabber. When I get on live, it is my time. Like, the kids go and do their own thing for a little while, and I sit down and enjoy doing my makeup. Because once I get done doing my makeup, it's, like, wide open for the rest of the day. Especially yesterday. Oh, my goodness. Um, I had three trainings to attend to. Um, and they felt like they were back-to-back. -back. We had one at 11.30, then we had one at 3, then we had one at 6.00. I mean, so being a mom of three, trying to get stuff done in between that was kind of hard. And so I'm booking it yesterday. I mean, I got the dishes done. I got the house vacuumed. Um, got the hardwood floor vacuumed. I got laundry done. Dinner cooked by a certain time. Kid, All the kids got a bath last night. I'm like, dang, I got all this done today? What? And I'm sipping coffee. Yes, I am sipping. I love coffee. <laughs> I, done, I drank all of the little coffees that my husband got me for Mother's Day already. They're gone. All right, so I'm coming in with the Cosmic Pigment. I'm going to be using it on my lids. And that's why I don't understand. I did all that yesterday. Running after kids, all these chores, training back to back to back. And I could not sleep worth a fart last night. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm like, what is going on? I have some of the weirdest phrases, y'all. So, all right. Usually when I put eyeshadow on my lid, I will use my finger. And so today I'm going to try it, even though this really loose pigment. <laughs> but we're going to try. I just prefer to use my finger. That's gorgeous. I like that. My eyebrows kind of wonky. It'll do. <laughs> Y'all remember on Shrek when Shrek was like, "That'll do, donkey. That'll do." That's how I do my kids sometimes. Like, "That'll do, child. That'll do." <laughs> and they're like, "Stop 
talking to me. <laughs> I mean, they don't say it, but you can just see it all over their face. Stop talking to me. <laughs> they gotta remember, Shrek came out when I was a kid. Be sitting there talking to me about Shrek. They'll sit there and watch Shrek and try to tell me about it. Like, well, he did this and this. I'm like, I'm the OG kids of when Shrek came out. Like, it came out in my generation. <laughs> I was like, I don't know, how old was I when Shrek came out? Like, nine, ten, something like that. God, no, that made me feel old. <laughs> I swear. All right, so I'm going to take my blending brush and just blend right quick. Just make sure everything's where it's supposed to be. I might add some more of that cosmic here in just a second. Mm, yeah, I need just a little bit more on this side. If it's aggravating you, honey, don't do it for a little while. I'm trying to teach them that if something aggravates you, stop and walk away for a few minutes. Okay. Okay, so I think I'm done with the cosmic. Excuse me. All right. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do next. If I want to do the outside corner of my eye or do I want to go ahead and do up underneath first? Decisions, decisions. I'm going to go ahead and do the um, underneath my lid, waterline, whatever, first. Alright, so I'm going to use that violet, cos um, violet pigment up underneath my lash line, waterline. Ah, if I can get it right today. I'm going to have a little bit more. Kids make me so nervous when they're coming down from the playroom, though. Because their stairs coming from the playroom is, like, really steep. It's like this. I'm so scared they're going to fall down the stairs. If I hear them coming down the stairs, I'll sit there and pause and listen. Like, they good? I'm one of those paranoid moms. Freaking paranoid about everything. <laughs> Are they okay? Are they sleeping good? Are they gonna fall down the stairs? Do they have a booger hanging out of their nose? I mean, you know what I'm saying? I'm just one of those moms. I'm a worry wart. My child, my three-year-old, she tried to jump off the stairs the other night. Didn't quite land the way she anticipated she was. And um, at first, I'm like, oh my gosh, are you okay? And then I'm like, I told you. <laughs> I told you not to do that. The kids can't stand it when I say I told you. All right, so I'm coming right on in with, it is a blush, but I use it as um, eyeshadow just because this blush is a little darker than what I normally would wear as blush. So, I'm using it as eyeshadow. I'm going to be putting it on the outside corners of my eyes. Worry, worry. Uh, I know. Put us together. We worry about everything. I swear. Why? Do y'all know why it's been so cold the past couple days? I've been going outside, letting the dogs out in the morning, and I brought the freeze my tushy off. I'm like, what is this? We are in the south in May. What the heck is this? <laughs> you know? I actually had to go get a jacket this morning to go let the dogs out. I'm like, why? Like, in the south. <laughs> Come on. But, this morning tripped me out so bad. I went to take the dogs outside like I normally do. And um, our outside kitty decided that she was going to be brave and jump in the backyard while my dogs are in the backyard. I'm like, honey, no, 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 no. About the time she got up onto my back porch, one of my dogs seen her 
and bolted after her. I'm running across the backyard. Daisy, no! <laughs> like, 9 o'clock in the morning, my neighbors are probably sitting on their back porches, sipping their coffee. Like, what in the hell is she doing now? Excuse my language, but I swear my neighbors probably think I'm crazy. <laughs> I do too. I'm an overthinker when it comes to my kids. Heat at night? I don't know. I get kind of hot. I'll turn the fan on. I cannot sleep without a fan. Like, at least the ceiling fan. It's, it's, it's background noise because if it's completely quiet, my mind will start to take off on me. Like, what's happening? Who's saying this behind my back? You know, so I, I try to have some sort of background noise because um, I don't like to sleep with the TV on anymore because I'll end up laying there with my eyes half open watching TV when I'm supposed to be going to sleep. Like, I don't know. My mind can be so tired to the point of collapsing, but then I can force myself to stay awake, and I hate it. Like, I really wish I could sleep. It's going to catch up to me eventually, and I'm going to be knocked out for like three days. So if I'm MIA for about three, four days, you know I'm hibernating. <laughs> oh, wouldn't it be nice to just hibernate for a little while? I've got to brush this part of my mop. I'm trying so hard to not keep putting it up. It's difficult. It is very difficult to break that habit. See, another habit I have to break. <sighs> personal growth, right? Personal growth. Sometimes it's hard. <laughs> it really is. I swear. Alright, so I'm just going to put a little bit more of that dark berry on the outside corner of my eye. I want to get it just a little bit darker. You see how it's going from light to dark? And you can start to see my eye. This one get a little bit bigger. That's what I'm wanting. I want my eye to look a little bigger. Because right now, I look like I'm half dead. Just exhausted. I love it. I want some more of it. Ooh, ooh. I'm sorry, y'all. I gotta be myself. I've, I've come on live a lot and just tried to be more, I don't know, laid back than how I really am. My sister-in-law's on here. She'll tell you I'm not usually this laid back all the time. <laughs> I had a good time on Saturday, though. I had a really good time. You get us, you get our, our family together. There ain't no telling what kind of shenanigans is about to happen, are about to happen. Like, <laughs> but I will tell you one thing: our family loves the crap out of each other. We always got each other's back for sure. We might get into a spit every now and then, but it's always smoothed over pretty quickly. I've known my in-laws for years, even before we, my husband and I got married. <laughs> it's crazy. What was that? Hey, leave the cats alone. They'll come to you if they want snuggles. I thought she done let one rip in there. She's like, I was blowing on the cat's stomach. You might not want to do that, honey. Cat will spaz out and scratch you. The cat's name Spaz, too, by the way. She is a complete spazoid. Y'all remember that cartoon? It was a long time ago. Like, I was still little. Called Freakazoid. I don't know if anybody remembers that. Every time I ask that, people are like, what are you talking about? Freakazoid! Man, that used to be my jam back in the day. That and Inspector Gadget. I loved Inspector Gadget. Do 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 do. <laughs> Inspector Gadget. <laughs> all right, I'm coming into the highlighter palette, and I'm going to use this pink one right here. Excuse all the fallout, but like I said, I still need to clean up my stuff. I did take the stuff and clean my brushes last night, though. So. Ooh, ooh. And I'm going to come into the inner corner of my eye. 
and then my brown lines. My daughter, my youngest daughter, she knows that her birthday's coming up pretty quick. And so she's like, it's my birthday, and it's my birthday. I'm like, not yet. She's like, yes, it is. <laughs> okay. She said, I'm celebrating all month, mama. Even though her birthday is next month. I can't believe she's about to be four years old. Golly. Like, where does the time go? Like, seriously. And her cousin is literally six weeks younger than she is. So, it's Allison. And then six weeks later, her cousin's turning four. And I'm like, oh, oh my gosh. When they were babies, they looked like twins. They really did. I'm like, whoa. And if you put them side by side together now, they look like sisters. They really do. It's so cute. They are so sweet. I can't believe all our babies getting big though. Like stop. Because that means I'm just getting old. <laughs> stop it. You know? Alright. I'm trying to figure out if I want to wear eyeliner. And if so, what color? Because I don't want to use black. I don't think I do anyway. Y'all, this brow is all kind of out of office. Let's see if I can fix it. That's a little better. Okay. I think. Okay, yeah. I'll use the extra last eye pencil. It's a purple violet color. I'm going to use that. And. I'll use white on my waterline. My eye just looks a little bit bigger. I swear I look like I'm about half asleep. Alright, so this is the violet, the extra last eye pencil. Matter of fact, this is the first eye pencil out of the extra last line that I've gotten. Usually, I use the express pencils, but this one is different. This is a twist up kind. Yeah. Most of the time when I come live and start doing my makeup, I don't even know. Like, I want to know what I know what I want to do. I know how I want to do it. But as far as how I think it's going to turn out, it looks completely different. But it still looks pretty cool. So half the time I have, I'm just as shocked at how my makeup turns out as y'all are. <laughs> like, seriously. father-in-law was so sweet the other day. He was over there at my nephew's um, 13th birthday party. He's like, wow, the makeup that you've been posting lately has been so good. Like, you're usually good with your makeup. The past couple times, you've just been so pretty. And I'm like, oh, well, thank you. <laughs> I was like, not even expecting that. It threw me off guard. I'm not used, I don't take compliments very well. Like, I'm like, are you, you're talking to me? Really? I, I get so awkward once I realize that you're actually complimenting me. It's it's bad. Alright, so a little bit of white eyeliner on the lash line. Kids in high school used to call me psycho because I could sit there and take eyeliner and put it on without blinking or making any kind of face. Yeah, I just made my eye look super big. But I poked myself in the eyes, so now my eyes watering. Alright. I wonder if we're going back to normal work schedule for hubs. 
Um, I haven't heard anything different. So hopefully it's back to normal because this schedule that they've had the past couple weeks has been like an emotional roller coaster for everybody. Do I have training today? Yes, I have training almost every single day for the next three months. I am working with some of the best of the best when it comes to um, our team. Um, actually getting to talk with one of the presidents of um, pharmacy, the fir one of the first people that actually, you know, became a beauty influencer and made it to the top from in the United States because we've only been in the United States since January of 2019. Um, so I'm getting to work with some of like the, you know, big dogs and I'm sitting here like humbled you know really humbled that I get to work with these people and learn from them and get to ask them questions and like oh my gosh you know like oh my gosh like when I found out that I had cho been chosen to be a part of that training I cried because I felt like my sponsor had that much faith in me but hey come on let's do this you know and I'm like oh <laughs> I was, it was a very humbling moment. Yes, it was nice. Um, about the only time that I've seen on the schedule for this month that we don't have any training is on the weekends. Um, um, a lot of the trainings are at eight o'clock at night um, when I'm getting the kids in the bed. So I'm having to like listen to my trainings. I'm like, come on, y'all go to bed. <laughs> And then, of course, I got to get Alice in the bed. And here lately, she's been wanting to just lay in the bed, talk, and roll around. I'm like, honey, lay down. Go to sleep. I'm trying to listen. But I ain't missed anything. None of them. I've been right there. Excuse me. All right, so I was just brushing up my eyelashes just a little bit because um, when I put that lash and eyebrow serum in my eyelashes, um, I don't want them to stick when I put mascara on. Like, they're already dry. I just don't want my lashes to stick. All right, so I've been having my mascara sit between my legs this entire time, so it's nice and warm. And I've noticed that when you put your mascara between your legs and warm it up before you put it on it goes on so much easier like it really does and of course I'm using the Zen mascara this will forever be my favorite now I should have just listened to my sponsor from the very beginning like I asked her I was like what is your favorite mascara and she's like the Zen and I'm like but we have other mascaras on there and they're more expensive and I thought that the more expensive mascaras that we have would be better so I tried them like mm, I'm just not feeling it order the Zen mm, try it because I get half off so this tube would be regularly $8.90 I got it for like four dollars and 45 cents can't beat that so I'm, like, I'm gonna try it y'all this is the best mascara I have ever used really for my price at four dollars and 45 cents like okay yes take all my money <laughs> I did just make a boo-boo though you got a little bit up underneath my eye. that's okay like I said I will put um, eye makeup on first and then put on face makeup. That way, if I make any kind of boo-boos, I can fix it. But I do feel like my vision's starting to get a little bit blurry. Um, I don't poke myself in the eye too many times. Going live this morning. Hi, hope you're having a good day. Big lashes. All right. So, hmm. I used CC cream yesterday. So I don't. I don't know if I want to use that again today. Hmm. Oh, 
about dropped it. Let's see. Yeah, I think I'll use VFX today. And I'm gonna mix the two colors together that I have. I have OO, which is porcelain, and I have O1, which is vanilla. Um, mixing those two together makes the perfect shade for me, and that's okay. Sometimes, you know, you gotta um, mix and match just a little bit. I would rather mix and match than get a shade that's closer to my skin tone and then not match at all. You know what I'm saying? I would rather be able to match beautifully. Alright. Good on my neck. Wanna make sure I blend all my neck. Of course I'm not gonna be blending with this brush though. I never blend my foundation with this brush. And just mix it. Oh, it's so nice and soft. I just cleaned it. Oh my gosh. It's the best feeling ever. Kind of like SpongeBob singing, it's the best day ever. Yep. It's the best brush ever. So clean and soft. <laughs> you go hang it all this good and blended. Oh, y'all, my hair is killing me. <laughs> I... I'm half tempted to just shave my head and start over. I'm just kidding. No, not really. Not really. But it would be nice if my hair would actually cooperate instead of acting like a resilient teenager, a defiant teenager. All right, I just dropped something. All right, so everything is good and blended, but because I have just a little bit extra on my hand, I'm gonna go ahead and blend it onto my face because I can't stand being wasteful ever. I hope my little three-year-old didn't just go in there and decide to take a deuce because I'm on live and she's still at the point where I have to wipe her butt for her. All right, I need to fix this eyebrow again because it got messed up when I was blending the foundation. Hi, hope you're having a good day. Okay, y'all, I'm over. Hang on just a second. Done. I am done, done, done with this. I don't even care at this point if my hair looks all wonky. Oh, there's my child calling for me. Hang on just a second. about that guys <laughs> she is um about to be four years old and she knows how to use the potty and if she goes tt she knows how to wipe herself but today she's like you wipe i think it's because she knows i'm alive but nope you gotta get off all right i got off camera and got completely sidetracked 
try to collect my thoughts right quick. What was I doing? All right, so I did foundation. I think I'm gonna use the contour stick today. I haven't used it in a while, so it kind of makes me nervous. But then again, the pigment pigments make me nervous too, and I went ahead and used those today. So let's try it. If it works, it works. It don't, it don't. Okay. Yeah, I usually don't use a contour stick, so it's taking me a minute, guys. I feel catawampus. <laughs> I... Do y'all hear her in there giggling? That's so cute. Okay, let's see if I can get this good and blended. I'm so not used to using the contour stick, guys. Don't even start fighting. Not too bad. For somebody that doesn't use the contour stick very often, not too bad. Hope so anyway. Not hoping I'm not just sitting here just hyping myself up and y'all on the other side going, what the heck is she doing? <laughs> I'm concentrating now, guys. <laughs> I don't usually use this, and now I'm just like, Ew. am I doing okay? <laughs> Nothing grows in the comfort zone, though. You're finally on season two of Smallville. Yes! Yes, it only gets better, girl. We are about to start um, season six tomorrow night. We got to finish this. We got to finish the finale of season five, and then we're gonna move right on to season six. I'm so tickled. I'm excited. Like that is my jam. That is my show. All right. So that is doom. I'm trying to make sure I blended it all good. My camera and then my mirror looks to like total different. So I'm hoping that's okay. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna put just a little bit of concealer on all the places that I want to highlight. 
I'm gonna blend that in. Um, and then I'm gonna do some blush. How are you liking it so far, season two? Oh, season one is, um, when Lana was, they were still in high school. I can't say nothing else. I might feel like I'm telling too much. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Not, uh-uh, no. Knock it off. Quit being bossy. This is how it started yesterday, isn't it? Yes. No. My kids, past couple days, have gotten up thinking that it's okay to just push from the time they get up to the time they go to bed just to see what I'm gonna do. And I'm like, I ain't doing it. I ain't doing none of it. Oh, <laughs> I can't say anything, because if I say anything, I can't, I just, I can't tell you. <laughs> the tornado sees, uh, Tornado episodes scared the crap out of me because I have like a huge phobia of tornadoes. Like, huge phobia. So it freaked me out to the point where I'm laying in the bed holding my breath with tears pouring down my eyes going <laughs> Like seriously, I was terrified. I'm just a weenie, okay? I'm just a weenie. Especially when it comes to natural disasters like that, though, golly. <laughs> it's like something that you just really can't prepare for. It's either going to suck you up or you're going to survive, you know? It's just, you can't, you can't really. Tornadoes are weird. Tornadoes are scary. So, hi, hope you're having a good day. Oh, yay. I swear, my allergies are getting the best of me. I, I think that's what it is, my allergies. I've been really sidetracked lately. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. You're not late. We buy toys from the toy store. You bought toys from the toy store? That's awesome. This is all the toys. Cool. I I've seen it. I got a notification that's up here that's bothering me. I have been so ticky lately about what's on my screen um, when I'm trying to do makeup. I can't stand notifications. <laughs> Y'all, this new phone has got a killer battery, for real. Like, my old phone, I would go live and it would be like drained. This phone, I mean, it's like barely gone. When I get off, I'm like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> So I ended up getting the Galaxy S10 and my sister texted me like a day or so after I got my phone. And she's like, what phone did you get? I said a Galaxy S10. She she went and got a Galaxy S10 Plus for Mother's Day. <laughs> I'm like, all right then. She needed a new phone though. She had um one of those S9s. And um, from what I read on Google, they like overheat and catch on fire. And so I'm like, eh, you know, you need a new phone. I'm such a worry wart. <laughs> Because knowing my luck, it would be me, one of those people that their phones just blow up, you know? How long the mirror is supposed to charge? No, it's been so long since I've charged my makeup mirror. I couldn't tell you. I don't even know where the charger's at. Um, the light that I use is from the tripod, and then I just look at the mirror in front of me. I haven't turned this thing on since I got it. Almost. <laughs> um, I got it. It was either my birthday or Christmas. No, it was Christmas because I got the tripod for my birthday. Um, yeah. But yeah, I haven't really turned on but maybe a couple times.
Matter of fact, I'll probably even have to order a new charger for it, to be honest. I don't have a clue where my charger's at. That's one thing I can't keep up with is chargers. You can't expect me to do it. <laughs> My little dog tickled the snot out of me this morning. So while my big dog, one of my bigger dogs, Daisy, because I have two big dogs, Daisy decided to go after our outside cat. And I'm running after the cat and the dog. I'm like, no, 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 don't get the cat. Because the cat's not supposed to be coming into the backyard. <laughs> and um, my little dog, Gutter's just, well, all this is going on, he's over there rubbing his butt in the dirt. Like, yeah, that feels good. I'm like, It should be okay to charge overnight. I don't see why not. I don't see why not. It shouldn't be a problem. All right, so I just put on concealer and put a little bit of transparent powder. And let that sit for a minute. While that's sitting, um, I'll be putting on blush like quick. I'm gonna come in with number 18 again. I used it yesterday, but I like it, so I'm gonna use it again. It's like a light pink shimmery color. I'm going pink, so I might as well do pink blush, right? I love this blush. Like, I won't be running out of it. If I get low, I'm going to order it, like, right now. <laughs> Uh, no, I can't run out of this one. This is one of my favorites. The other one is my that's my favorite is number 15. And I really, I don't know where it's at right now. Like, I was going to use it yesterday and I'm looking through my makeup and I just could not find it. And the kids are like, I haven't been over here. I think my cats are starting to knock stuff off and scooting it down the house. Like, I'll close my stuff. I close all of it. And they'll take it off, the, they'll sit on the uh, table and push it off, and then push it around the house like a dago hockey puck. Thank you. Have fun. Yeah, I definitely want to see. Oh, I got something. There we go. I don't know what that was. So I'm moving right along. I'm going to come back into the highlighter palette. This hair, y'all. All right, back into the highlighter palette. I'm going to use this pink again. Um, you got pink, gold, and this bronze color. This bronze color is super pretty for eyeshadow, but um, too dark for me to use as like highlight. Um, but I love this pink. It's really soft, like shiny, and that's what I want right now. I'm using the pigments, and they're super shiny. So love you too. Hope you have a good day. So. I want to I shine like a shooting star. I love this shirt. This is another one of the shirts my husband got me for Mother's Day. It's Hustle. How cute! Because that's all I ever do was hustle. Work hard for what I want. It's like that thing I keep saying to the kids, can't stop, won't stop, can't stop, won't stop. Mm -mm -mm. They don't like it, but they won't be little couch potatoes lately. They don't want to do nothing. <laughs> I'm like, can't do that. Hmm. I think instead of today of using a liquid lipstick, I might be using um, one of our matte lipsticks. Um, just gotta figure out which one I want to use. I haven't used a matte lipstick in forever. So, I've got to figure out which one I want to use. Because, um, I mean, when I first started pharmacy, I used them a lot. But now that I've got all these liquid lipsticks, I haven't really touched them. <laughs> Alright, so I'm taking off a little bit of this transparent powder. I'm looking like a ripe old zombie today. I have been steadily putting my videos on YouTube. Um... Every, t every day that I go live, I'll put that live on YouTube. I'm trying to figure out how to build um, my platform, the algorithm, and 
all that. I'm, I never even thought to use YouTube, much less know how to use it for this. <laughs> so everything's a learning experience right now. All right, so I'm putting just a little bit of that pink highlight right here underneath my eye, but right on top of where I put that blush. felt so good the other night when we went over to my nephew's 13th birthday party um what would she be to me let's see is my uh, my husband's nephew so it's gonna be his wife my niece-in-law I guess niece-in-law but she's like oh my gosh your skin looks so clear and I'm like are you talking to me? <laughs> because I felt like, you know, I had to use full coverage to cover myself up that day. And I'm like, are you talking to me? <laughs> She's like, yeah. And I was like, oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. That's right. That's right. We will have our own empires one day. No, I'm saying. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I, you told me. You did. <laughs> I'm a hard-headed fart. I mean, excuse my language, but I'm hard-headed. I am very hard-headed. Okay, so it's in between these two, and these are the um, samples that I got in my sample kit, okay? So this one is, what is this one? This one's Posh Plum. That's super pretty. It's pink-ish, purplish pinky, maybe. And then this one is Plum Sunrise. So you got Posh Plum and then uh, Plum Sunrise. I can't figure out which one I want to use. I've got so much makeup on my hand right now. I have not. I have not. Mm -mm. Shoot. I don't really like subscription stuff too much because I'm like, what if I don't want it this month? Can I send it back and get my money back? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I just, I don't know. I've really never really thought about it. Um, is that for the subscription part? I'm like, mm. I don't know. I think I'm going to use um, Posh Plum today. Mm. I don't know. Ah, I can't, I'm so indecisive. Yeah, I don't know. I've been debating too. I just, I just, I don't know. I kind of like, I'm kind of really fond of what I'm using right now. Yeah. These are the matte lipsticks. These are the samples that came with my, um, starter kit. Y'all, I can't even say, oh yeah, yeah. I can't hardly think this morning. I don't really use these much often anymore. Wait. Very often. Just doing stuff different today since, you know, I'm like, I want to play with pigments and stuff like that. So, might as well do something different. But I'm definitely not used to this lip color, though, goodness. But, everything's pink, right? Um, when I do get off and take a selfie of my makeup, I'm going to do something with my hair. I can't just leave it like this, because I think putting my hair down would complete the look. <laughs> I think it would. Alright, so just a little bit of time locker setting spray, and then I might do something with my hair. Y'all, my hair's going to be bad once I bring it down, though. It's horrible. <laughs> Alright. So let's try to do something with this hair real quick. When I put my hair up, it's hard to get it down, too. 
I have really thick hair and it looks like a frizzy mess most of the time. All right. Like I put the top part up this morning because when I had it down, my hair was going ching, ting, ting, ding. <laughs> I believe she'll pass this year, but I don't go anywhere either. I put on makeup anyway. It makes me feel better. It makes me feel a lot better. I feel like even though I'm not going anywhere, I can still conquer the day. Like I'm still on top of the world and I can get done. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes I just need an extra boost. I'm like, come on, you can do this. All right, go get pretty. Go look at yourself in the mirror. I'm like, girl, you got this. And then I go about my business. <laughs> Sometimes we just need to pep talk ourselves and do stuff to make ourselves feel better, even though we're not going to go anywhere. Like, you know, I don't go anywhere. My husband's like, you look so pretty. And, <laughs> it's, you know, it just, it makes me feel good. But um, I really do think that she's going to pass. Because um, aren't report cards being mailed out next week or something like that? I don't know. I don't know anything about the school system because I've been homeschooling for three years. <laughs> Going on four this year. Golly. I swear. Where's the time going? Seems like just yesterday. And you're like, you know what? I'm just going to homeschool y'all. <sighs> they kept getting in trouble at school. Kept getting sent home with a note from the teacher almost every day. <laughs> on top of that, they were getting bullied. And I wasn't having it. You know, we had talked to the counselor at the school. We had talked to the principal. We even went to the Board of Education. And they're like, oh, well, what we can do is just separate them. And, you know, they're just going to have to leave each other alone. Your child is being a little to mine, you know. So, come on. And then, you know, a lot of times when I take my hair down, my hair wants to get stuck in the hair tie. Of course it would when I'm live. And it looks like a rat nest. This week is makeup weekend. That's right. That's what I say to myself. I'll wear my makeup, I'll get my stuff done, and then I'll go about my business. I'm just going to have to... This hair tie, I swear, I need some of them scrunchies because my hair gets wrapped up in these hair ties so bad. I'm not even going to show y'all on camera. Don't. Mm -mm. It's bad. It's super bad. Like, ugh. I'm sitting here having to unravel my hair out of this daggum hair tie. Like it's horrible. Oh. On live. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> but yeah, I want to do something with my hair. Even if it's just brushing it. Um, like I said, I don't do hardly anything with my hair. I will wash it. And I will let it air dry. And I will brush it. And that's about it. <laughs> I'm serious. Yeah. But yeah. That's about it. So, me wanting to do anything with my hair is usually just brushing it, maybe blow drying it every now and then. Like, Saturday was the first time I blow dried my hair in months. Literal months. I think last time I blow dried my hair before Saturday was when I got my hair highlighted. Love the way I think about things. I, for the longest time, I didn't think this way. You know, I had to actually push myself to think like this. Because so I was always one of those, the world hates me kind of people. And I was like, nah, 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 I gotta get out of this. I was so depressed, like so bad. Before, I'm just kicking myself in my own arse. I'm like, no, no. Because I'm not on any kind of antidepressants or anxiety medication or anything like that. I'm pretty much, it's me kicking my own arse. I'm not cursing though. <laughs> like, I try so hard to watch my mouth and so I don't think that's a curse word. Now, if you said it the other way, yes. But, but yeah, I mean, I, like, I went through really bad postpartum. Like, really bad. And my OBGYN, after the six week mark, she's like, Okay, you're not my, you know, you're not postpartum anymore because you're six weeks postpartum. Thank you. That's so sweet. But, um, um, so ever since then, my daughter will be four in June, June 2nd. So, 
it's been almost four years since I've been on any kind of antidepressants, um, anxiety medications, Mama. or anything like that. Um, Can I have my helping juice? Your what juice? Oh, helping juice. What is that? It's my helping juice to get down. Okay. She's like, helping juice? What the heck is helping juice? <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it took a lot for me to have to kick my own behind. But no, 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 no. You can't do this. Because I literally thought the world hated me. And I was just, you know, you know how it gets. But if you ever need a pep talk, just message me and I'll pep you up. I'm all about helping others try to feel good about themselves. Okay. So I finally did something with my hair. <laughs> Y'all, it was a mess. Oh my God. Sitting there on live trying to get that hair tie out. I really do need scrunchies. So I might put that on like a wish list or something. So, <laughs> all right guys. What time is it? Oh wow. It's not even 11 o'clock. I need to start going live earlier because now I feel like I got more time throughout the day to actually get stuff done. Like, I gotta go start laundry though. I gotta start laundry and what else did I say I forgot I did? Didn't do. Take my medicine. Yeah, I take medicine in the morning. I completely forgot because I'm like, I decided getting on camera. I was like, I'm going to play with these pigments. So, I need to go take my medicine, guys. So, I hope y'all stay blessed, stay safe, and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.